Hey guys, honestly Erica. In this video, I'm going to be experimenting with Razul clay and this time I'm going to be using bentonite. So in this mixture, I'm going to be using obviously Razul, bentonite clay, aloe vera juice, and olive oil. To start, I use a fourth a cup of bentonite clay, a fourth a cup of Razul clay, I eyeball the olive oil, and about a half a cup of aloe vera juice. So the reason why I'm using bentonite clay with my Razul clay um, for my hair this time is because bentonite clay is has a very cleansing, purifying properties. So I thought that would be an excellent way to cleanse my hair as well as give it some conditioning and moisture. This mixture was a little bit too watery, so I add just a little bit more of the bentonite and the Razul clay. Then I just mix it all together until I get the consistency that I like. Okay, so I'm all done mixing. This is the consistency I'm left with. It's a little bit uh, thick. Uh, smooth so, so it should be pretty easy to apply um, I'm starting off with my hair it is wet just because I ran it underwater because super tangled and I'm not I have no plans of detangling my hair um, but yeah so I just ran under water just to make it easier to apply the mask to So with this mixture, I make sure I really get in there and get my scalp really well and try to coat my scalp with the product um, because the bentonite clay is really cleansing so I wanted to see how clean I could get my hair and my scalp. I'm just going to apply the mixture to my hair and to my scalp and try to get it on at least most of my strands. So now that my hair is coated with the Razul and bentonite clay mixture, I'm just going to put on my shower cap and let it sit for probably about a half an hour. So this is my hair freshly out of the shower where I rinse with lukewarm water. My hair is really light, really fluffy, pretty defined. Now with this mixture, it wasn't my favorite just because my hair is not as soft and as moisturized as the other experiments, but I do like the bentonite clay because it left my scalp and my hair very clean. Um, so yeah, I will be incorporating bentonite clay in my hair regimen in the future. Maybe I will replace my tear essentials with some sort of mixture I come up with. Um, let me know what you guys think. Thank you for watching. Bye!